Hi, this is Lauren Stiles. I'm talking today to James Cadden. He is one of the directors who submitted a film into the Alberta Student Film Festival, which is playing Friday, March 20th. Doors are at 6.30 p.m. Screenings begin at 7. And also on Saturday, March 21st, doors are at 6.30 p.m. and screenings begin at 7. And both of these are at the Metro Cinema. How are you doing today, James? I'm doing fine. Thank you, Lauren. So what film did you submit to the festival this year? I submitted Zombie Apocalypse, and that was originally made for a contest that the U of A Society for Creative Filmmaking hosted last October called the Halloween Horror Competition. It's basically about three university students who are caught up in the chaos and struggle of a zombie apocalypse and their attempt to survive it. And how did you do in the Creative Filmmaking Society competition? Uh, Well, it actually won Best Film, which was quite nice because uh, it was really down to the wire for actually getting it complete in time. It was completed on the day of the screening, actually about an hour after it was supposed to start. People actually really enjoyed it too, which was also quite nice because the hard work paid off. So it it was really nice to see everyone just happy and clapping and cheering when the zombies came on. And, you know, there was gore effects, which Haley provided with liquid latex and uh, corn syrup. So it was all in all a really, really nice kind of surreal experience for me. What was your role in Zombie Apocalypse? Well, my role in Zombie Apocalypse was uh, director, one of the producers, and editor, even uh, a brief stint as actor. I also did uh, some of the additional sort of atmospheric music for the film. How was your experience with the festival last year? Uh, I did win uh, the Best Film Award last year at the Alberta Student Film Fest for Fergoth. It was really quite a surprise on my part because I didn't think it would win. I thought I would um, receive perhaps a prize for maybe best editing because the movie had a lot of uh, special effects in it. Do you plan on checking out any of the other films this year? Yeah, I mean, it it would be rude to just, I guess, show up for only your film and then leave without watching any of the others. But no, I I definitely plan to check out, uh, well, basically all the other films I can see. So what other films are you going to check out this year at the festival? I'm quite looking forward to uh, seeing two other films by uh, fellow society members. Uh, There's uh, Tito Gillian's Surreal, which was actually filmed in the summer of 2007, I believe, and it's just been in development hell for quite a long time because he has this animated character in it, and from my understanding, there was uh, just issues getting that completed in time for last year's festival, so it's nice to finally get a chance to check that out. The other film I'm excited to see is uh, Blake Mayen's uh, Welcome, and that was actually the film that received the $10,000 grant from the Alberta Foundation for the Arts last year. That was filmed, uh, from my understanding, at the end of last August, and that was actually done on 35 millimeters. So that should look, uh, you know, really, really nice because 35 millimeters is what the professionals use. So I'm, I'm quite looking forward to that. I'm also looking forward to just seeing any other films that I've haven't heard about before, but should be good because they're getting shown. And everyone listening should come check out the films as well.